Derek, a 4-0 defeat, just uh, your overall thoughts on that game? Yeah, it became a difficult game for us. I think that uh, you know MK Dons moved the ball around very well. Uh, they got into space, you know, well as well. And uh, the first two goals they scored were, you know, crosses into the box. And uh, Greg has run off, you know, one of our defenders to get ahead of them and flick the ball into the bottom corner. And uh, good movement from him, poor defending from us. And uh, we made the change at half time. Uh, we changed the the system. We changed the player. And uh, in the second half, you know, we, we got into the game and created uh, a lot of good opportunities. We probably should have got head back in the game. Even in the first half with Ryan Delaney's header, it was a great save from their goalkeeper. But uh, over the afternoon, I think they were very clinical uh, when they had their opportunities and uh, we weren't so good in front of goal. I was going to say, was that the big difference between the two sides on the day? Yeah, I mean, I think chances-wise, we had a lot of chances in the game and... Uh, you know, very good chances at that and we probably should have scored uh, a few goals but unfortunately today we didn't. Uh, MK Dons were clinical and uh, deserved to win. Was one of the annoying things that both their opening two goals looked exactly the same basically to the eye? Yeah, I mean we didn't deal well with Griggs' movement in the box and uh, that was the hard thing. Uh, he's a top striker, he scored goals throughout his career but uh, you know, when you make movement in the box then you've got to deal better with it. Looking at the second half, you, you did play some really nice football and if you had got one back, things could have been different. Yeah, I mean, I think that if we had got back to 2-1, that would have obviously helped us and we had that opportunity to do that uh, on a number of occasions and we weren't able to get that. Then we got sucker punched, uh, we got counter-attacked, a slip ball down the side and uh, they make it 3-0. The fourth one, we lose the ball in the middle of the park, we're in good possession uh, and that's game over after that. But I thought that the players... You know, still kept going, they still wanted to try and get a goal, we still had opportunities in goal, we should have scored today but um, in the end they've been very clinical. Kieran Phillips came on and uh, his movement looked good early on in the second half. Yeah, I mean it's not easy to come on in the game that he did, he was 2-0 down at half time and then he came on and had a couple of opportunities, he probably should have scored but um, in the end you know, we've had other players in the team that should have done likewise. Jensen Weir came close on a couple of occasions couple of great saves as well by their keeper. Yeah, I mean, he should have scored. You know, he, he could have uh, got himself into the 18-yard box and he was unfortunate not to have, you know, got the ball into the goals. Overall, a 4-0 defeat, is it a lot to think about, a lot to take home with you tonight? Yeah, I mean, I think that, you know, the players, you know, have got to think about, you know, coming up against a difficult opposition, you know, players playing in holes, coming off, and I spoke to them about that. It's about communication. It's about noticing where players are uh, on the pitch and, uh, Today, MQ Dons were very good at that. We were good at, at times, you know, uh, causing them problems. And, uh, you know, we had the bulk of the second half. Again, I have to ask you, Cole Stockton again, still injured, John O'Beaker injured. Any news on Cole or any thoughts before the, the end of this, finally the end of this deadline? Yeah, we had six players out today, you know, either ill uh, or injured. So uh, that was the reason. Is Cole, do you think we've seen the last of him in the Morecambe shirt? No, I don't think so. I think that... Um, you know, he'll still be here, you know, come the end of the window. Any chance of anyone else coming in or with Kieran Phillips be your last one? You the think? only way that people would come in is if players went out. And at this stage, um, that's not going to happen. Adam Mayer came on. Nice to see you an academy player. Even just get a couple of minutes. Yeah, I mean, he just gave him a couple of minutes at the end. You know, he's been training with us. He, he was uh, in the squad on Tuesday night and, you know, he was unfortunate to... Uh, not to have got on on Tuesday night, but uh, we gave him some minutes today. And you got a chance to perhaps rectify things on Tuesday against Everton? Yeah, I mean, we've got uh, the opportunity to play on Tuesday night, then we're away to you know, Bristol Rovers next week. <laughs>